What's going on, YouTube? How y'all feeling today? This is your boy Jay. This is Creative Life. I do have another pickup for y'all. I've uh, been trying to be a little bit more consistent. Trying. Uh, I'm probably slow down on the shoes because we got to do more to the Monte Carlo, man. Now, I was able to get a few things done. Hold on, let me show y'all real quick. These ain't no major things, but I'm going to show y'all. Ooh, so... I was able to put this, get this filter put on. I finally got it timed uh, correctly. And I know y'all can't see it now because it's a little dark, but I was able to get the uh, harmonic balancer issue fixed. So now uh, the belt is, uh, you know, going straight uh, and it's not wobbling anymore. It sounds a little bit better. It's not as, as loud. It's a lot more quiet than it was. So that's good. I took the bottom part of the shroud off because my shroud is, uh, the fan is hitting the bottom of the shroud, so I take that off, uh, but I'm not moving it too much, so it ain't going to overheat or nothing like that. I know the shroud is important to push the uh, air back onto the engine and make sure, you know, that it's calm and cool and collective, so that's one thing. Uh, yes, so there's a good 350. Get another hood song. I'm gonna get a new fender song to put on here. And then I'm gonna work on getting a seat because my seat is broken. Getting the interior parts done. Sorry about that, y'all. Uh, but yeah, I took the cluster out because it's draining the battery. I don't know what that drain is coming from yet, but I'm working on that as well. And we're gonna. It's driving. It's in good condition. You know, it's moving. It's, it's the, the transmission is smooth and everything, but. Again, it's just stuff like that. Like, I got to get that cluster issue resolved. And I will pretty soon. I will pretty soon. All right. Uh, I do have my little gauges down there. That let me know if it's overheating or not. Or, you know, the voltage and also the oil. Which is cool. But I want the inside to be pretty much all original. You know, outside of the fact of the uh, the radio I'm going to put in there. But other than that, I don't, I don't want all the extra. Man. I ain't going to put no sounds in here. I just want it to ride good and look good. All right, let me get back to the shoe. All right, so picked up these joints today. These are not for me. These are for my old lady with her spoiled ass. As y'all can see, women's Air Jordan 8 retro, white, varsity red. That's crazy, white and varsity red. Uh, I hope y'all tags don't look like this. And these are the Aqua 8s. <laughs> Uh, as y'all can see, paid 205 with tax from the mall by my house. And I sent my stepdaughter to go pick these up because I had to work. But I wanted her to I wanted her to have these by the time she got home. We ended up sending the 13s back, the um atmosphere grade 13s. Cause it was a little bit too tight on her foot and they ain't had no other size but she really liked these and i actually think they're pretty cool man i know this camera ain't really doing it no justice and y'all know i'm working with one hand one hand man you know what i'm saying uh i like the that aqua color you know that aqua theme that boy nice this is what takes the cake for me if I can get everything to sit still. That purple bottom with that that mustard gold like these these boys smacking. And you got the little toy question right here. Got the varsity red right here. So as they talking about as far as varsity red and then the varsity red jump man. But oh yeah, and on that too. But yeah, these boys smacking. I, I like these. And you know, all around the gray is um has that uh, what is it called? Flashy material? Why am I saying flashy material? 3M. Goodness gracious. Anyway, got the 3M. The inside, the purple buoy. And the inside is a... I, mean, I don't even know if y'all can see that. We're going to try it. Oh, there we go. Got the white sole with the purple jump man. Uh, the lip print on the side is wicked too, man. I don't think people be noticing these little things like that. Like, or well, if they do notice it, they don't, you know, really put it out there. 
Like it's trying to focus. I don't know what that says, but it says something. But anyway, that's one shoe. This other one's out, y'all. Uh, she has tried these on already. And she likes them. Put this back up, y'all. I like how they keep using the older boxes as well, man, for nostalgic purposes. They is pretty cool, but... Alright, let them things go, man, and all that glory, as we say. I like them. I think she is going to do them some justice for the summertime. You know, they're going to smack. They're going to smack hard. You know, she just got it. Man, and she, you know, but it's one of her favorite colors. She like uh, teal. You know? That's one of her, like, exclusive favorite colors. But I wanted to make sure she had some, like, for the, some smacking for the summer. I know I've been buying a lot of shoes recently. For them, for me, we've just been buying a lot of shoes recently. So, and school about to get ready to kick back in next month for the suburban kids, and then September for the city students. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, I gotta get right back to it. Gotta make sure the kids got something nice to go back to school with. With my son, since he's still hard on shoes and he don't clean them. Actually, come to come to you know think about it. Don't none of my kid my kids clean their shoes. They lazy. I be having to clean their shoes. However, it ain't gonna happen no more. So they better get to it. But anyway, as far as these, you know what I'm saying? These these are smacking. As like I said, I'm gonna get my kids right for the summertime. I mean for the for school. They already got shoes and stuff now for the summer. And they don't really wear nothing but sandals and flip flops, stuff like that. Man, when I was a kid, man, we was happy to get them it, put on some clothes and throw on a nice shoe, you know? Even though it wasn't number hard, no, shell to Adidas. But for me, it was shell to Adidas. But now, man, these little mugs only just walk around with Nike slides and Adidas slides all day. It's crazy. Champion slides. But, I mean, it's, it's they, it's they move, so I'm going to let them enjoy it. I'm still going to keep doing me and, you know, rock my shoes. But, yeah, man, I think these is nice. The size and tag, if it focus. I like how they got the little barcode in there, too. You scan that joint. It'll show you, you know, if the shoe is available. I think that's pretty cool. You know, you never know. Somebody might not know the name of that shoe. You might go, oh, I just got these out the store. How do you know if they're available? Right, you know, scan the shoe real quick. You know what I'm saying? See if, you know, they on Nike or something. You can grab your pair. But, yeah. Shiny uh material, you know that three of them. I would turn the light on. Actually, hold on, let me see if I can turn the light on real quick. Hold on. So I turned the light on, and it still ain't really showing a three M. But whatever. It's it's three M material. Oh, there you go. There you go. Look at me being special. There go that three M material. Yeah. There you go. My fault, y'all, but there you go, right there. So as y'all see, hold on, let me see if I can catch the back of them joints too. Yeah, yeah. Catch the back of them joints for that 3 of But yeah, man. I wanted to make sure my wife had these joints uh, for the summertime. She is really, really keen on these. Now, I should have got the black ones, but I ain't like the glitter at the bottom of the black ones. If they made it like that without the glitter, I'd have had to have them, but... I ain't really like the glitter at the bottom of it. And everybody was saying like, oh man, you know, that's how it was when they came out back in the day. I don't think so. But whatever's whatever. I'm chilling out on shoes unless some, some overly smacking come out. Ooh, look how that yellow come through the bottom. <laughs> anyway, I'm chilling unless some, some smacking come out that I really just got to have. Other than that, man, we it's time to get this money Carlo going. You know? But yeah, man, just wanted to show y'all these real quick. Try to stay a little bit more uh, consistent. This is your boy, Jay. This is Creative Life. We are finna start doing more with the Monte Carlo. I want y'all to be smooth.